The race for president of the United States has a field of 40 plus candidates, two from Montana, one from Billings and one from right here in Red Lodge. Well, thank you. Yeah, please even say. though the 2024 election is well over a year off, that isn't stopping these candidates from hitting the campaign trail. Walter clap. I'm here to bull whip the bull. I'm here to bull whip. The Hi, I'm Corey Stapleton. I'd like to change the way we think about American politics. Corey Stapleton is no stranger to the political scene, first elected to the state Senate in 2000. He then served as Montana's Secretary of State. Now he's a financial advisor in Billings and the lead musician in his Corey Stapleton and the Pretty Pirates Band. Like Montana Freedom and a country. Now, Stapleton is stumping in early primary states looking to secure Super PAC support. I'm currently in New Hampshire, spent nearly a dozen years in uniform as a United States Naval officer. I've been serving my state and nation since I was a teenager. Walter Clapp is a 35-year-old political unknown and an attorney in Red Lodge. With a degree from Georgetown and age on his side, he says he's ready to bullwhip the biggest issues facing our nation. Here to bullwhip Trump border wall. I'm here to bull whip red die number 40. In November, I, I turned 35 and you know realized uh, that I was eligible. And I'm not going to go through Trump v. Biden again and, and watch these two 80 year olds that don't know anything about technology or AI, you know, try to confront what is, you know, one of the biggest challenges of our day. Both Clapp and Stapleton are pursuing the American dream. Stapleton aims to bring the country together and pay it forward by paying off national debt. And he says his lyrics don't hurt. I think it's a way to connect. The whole world speaks different languages. But we sing only one. For Clap, that dream looks like more representation. Today we have we have eight times worse representation in our lower house than a citizen of the United Kingdom. And we fought a revolutionary war on the idea of no taxation without representation. The numbers game is not lost on these two Republican presidential hopefuls. They know their campaign war chest pales in comparison to some candidates who've raised millions, but both say they're in it to win it. It just takes one billionaire, right, to, uh, to decide, hey, you know, we want to set up a super PAC. I'm Corey Stapleton. I approve this message. Walter Clapp. And I approve this message. In Red Lodge, Diane Parker, MTN News.